What is up guys? Welcome back to another Instagram tutorial. My name is Steven Womack and today I want to show you a highly requested look that I like a lot myself because I like the music at the moment. Um, we're talking about a German rapper once again. Luciano is his name and he just released a new single with a video and I really love the look of that video. It's that dark blue light. Go check out the video if you don't know it already. And today I want to show you how to create this Luciano inspired dark blue look using your smartphone and the free Lightroom app only. So I will show you this in a minute, but I've also created a preset on exactly this look. If you don't want to follow along to the whole tutorial or you don't really get it right, you can also download the preset. It's on my website. The link is under this video. It's in that all presets pack along with many more presets like Travis Scott, ASAP Rocky, Gunnar Stahl, uh, Jason Noir, UFO361, many, many more that can really upgrade your Instagram game. So check that out. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the notifications bell so you don't miss out on any of my future tutorials. And if there's any requests that you have to me, just DM me on Instagram at Stephen Womack. I'm always happy to hear from you and I'll try to reply as fast as I can or you can also always just comment under this video. Now I've said enough, let's jump right into this tutorial. The first thing you will have to do is open up that Lightroom app on your smartphone. Now I've chosen a picture of him in a parking garage with uh, Samba, he's another German rapper and the first thing you want to do is hit the light down here and go to curve on the upper right. And then let's take care of that blue curve first. So we go over to the blue right here and I want you to recreate this curve exactly as it is right here. So raise the shadows a lot and the highlights on the upper right, pull that over to the left and then in between create a bow towards the upper left side. Now, once you have this blue curve copied exactly as it is, your picture should go from this as the original to this right here to really add that blue tone and then you go over to the RGB curve right here and just try and imitate this as well um, pull down the highlights on the upper right a little bit and then create a bow towards the bottom right a little bit and as I said before it should switch from this to this and once you have these two curves copied exactly as they are here you're done and then you want to just pull down the exposure a little bit to negative 0.49 right here. And the contrast, you wanna pull that down to negative 52 right here. The highlights, we want to pull them all the way down to negative 100. And the shadows, we wanna pull down to negative 17 right here. The white, we wanna pull down all the way to negative 100. And the blacks, we wanna boost them up a little bit to in this case, plus nine works perfect. Then we go over to the color right here. And what you want to do is just pull down the temperature a little bit to negative six and the tint all the way to negative 100 right here to give that little green flash into the picture. Now the saturation, we want to pull that down to negative 42 in this case. And then we're done with the colors. We go over to the effects panel and here you just wanna pull down the texture to negative 32 and the clarity all the way to negative 57 right here to smoothen or soften out the picture and then dehaze to negative 28 right here to brighten it back up a little bit. Now we want to add some grain, let's say 16 works perfect just to give it that vintage camera vibe a little bit and now go to split toning on the upper right and this is where we're going to get the colors on point now for the highlights we want to pull over to a hue of around 55 and a saturation of 41 right here so this should really add a little bit of that yellow tone to the lights which we want and the shadows we pull over to a hue of 200 and 40, 44, 45, and a saturation of 14 in this case is good. So it's 244 and 14, that works perfect. And now we pull the balance towards the highlights to plus 35 right here, and we are done here. 
this is it, this is a before and after, and I think we really nailed this look. We came super close to that Luciano inspired blue, dark blue vintage um, camera look. And once again, I've created a preset on exactly this look. It's in my all presets pack. The link is under this video that will take you straight to the pack. And in that pack, there's a Travis Scott, ASAP Rocky, UFO 361, Jason Noir, and many, many more presets for you to really upgrade your Instagram game. So check that out for sure. And if you haven't already, also make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the notifications bell so you don't miss out on any of my future tutorials. Because if you request anything, the next tutorial could be for you. Just DM me on Instagram if you have any ideas for me, if you're wondering how to create some kind of specific look, um, or you could also always just comment under this video and I'll try to reply as fast as I can. Thank you so much for watching. I hope I'll see you in the next tutorial. Peace.